I'm ready. Yeah. Hold on. Let me save these words. Uh, I gotta make sure that I got a file. Yeah, I gotta erase it. Okay. Now I'm ready. Count us down, big man. Alright, you ready? Both of you? Yep. Mm -hmm. So, three, two, one, play the game. It's me, Mario! I was almost thrown off by play the game, but I managed to I know. bring it back. I, I realized afterwards that that was the bad idea, but... It's alright. I was in the middle of getting the only good run of this room that I've done so <laughs> far. Womp is a really hard boss. Here we go! 
I think anyone's ever died on the walk fight. I'm sure. Probably me. Yeah, I can't remember if I have it either, but I wouldn't be surprised if I have. Sometimes when you just get like flustered, like, the stupidest stuff happens. I feel like you have to be trying. I've gotten smushed by him like three times before. In one setting, or just like three yeah. times in history? No. Like, three times at once. It was terrible. <laughs> oh, so man. That's what happens when you do runs for like six hours straight, though. I've never done that. I think the most runs I've ever done... Really? well tonight. Oh yeah, I got under 15 seconds for this room that without strats before I was getting like 30 seconds on. No! I choked. Oh, that was a red Yeah. It's killing you. It's ruining my chances of winning in these races. But I also, like, I would go for it without Bowser Reds, but uh, the way my splits are now, it would mess up my gold splits. So I have to do Bowser Reds. Yeah, it's good practice anyway. Like forcing a no reset run when you're really trying it. Work. I don't know why I tried it. Fuck. It's okay, I also died on Bowser. It also gives Trey, like, a, an almost equal chance with you. Yeah. Because he's like, his BB is like five minutes behind yours. And, uh, Bowser Reds, if you die, is like a minute more time or whatever it is. Something like that. Probably like a minute, yeah. Depends on where you die. What star yeah. do you not get if you get Bowser Reds? Let's get the elevator one and, uh, Easy Maze Cave. Oh, easy Maze. Yeah. Oh, 
totally missed a throw. I can catch up. Yeah, normally I would be done with a uh, shifting sand one by now. Dang. Just now getting to the basement. Me too. I just now opened the door. My, uh... What? My summer best is 1907, but it says my best possible time is 16 at 16. <sighs> what? Oh, uh, your summer best. Wait, your summer best is 1907? Yeah. But it says my best possible time is 1616. 16. Oh, it's probably getting broken because you don't have all your splits in. Oh. So, like, your best possible time is taking. Zero as the value for the splits you don't have times four. That's my guess. I know, but I have gold splits now for those splits. Like, I don't have them finished in a run, but I have, uh, you know, best segments and stuff saved. Uh huh. So weird. I don't know. That is weird. That doesn't make sense because if my summer best isn't messed up, then how's that messed up? <laughs> yeah, dude, I don't know. I got shitty rolling rocks, RNG. It's gonna decide this race. Always do rolling rocks last because it's the scariest one. Really? I think the wall jump one is the scariest one. Oh, yeah. I've died on it a lot. I lost because of that, but it's okay. So I can still be me. I just got like the fastest mip split ever. Wow. And tech skip. Wow. Dude, I could PB. What? Do it. If I like get all three Bowser throws basically at the end and don't mess up Bowser too, I think I could maybe PB or come close to it. Here we go. 
be the craziest comeback. If I get early cycle, <laughs> that's like, I don't know. Yeah, that early cycle might be the only thing that could save it. But if you got it, it would be insane. I've never gotten early cycle even practice, so yeah, that would be insane. Oh yeah, I missed early cycle. I messed up some movement. I can't get it. You've never even gotten it in practice? Yeah, dude, it's ridiculous. You have to have perfect, like, pass movement. Oh, I can't get up for it. Because the guy that, uh, had the time on you, like, just a little, like, a minute faster than you or whatever it was, didn't do up warp, but he, uh, did get early cycle. Oh my god, dude. I can't get it up warp. What's wrong with me? I'm losing all of my, like, time. Dude, that's so annoying. Okay, finally. Have you seen the thing where Pancoke is offering $1,000 to whoever can figure out that one TikTok clock up warp? Yeah. No one's ever gonna get it, though. Oh, no. That's probably, just like, a, a one-time Just a, yeah, just a memory skip or something. Yeah, uh, Joseph said when he was, like, Joseph tried to get it, actually, like, pass it out to get it. Oh, yeah. He couldn't do it. And he said it was probably just, like, a piece of dust on the, like, contacts of the cartridge messed stuff up or something. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. Because it's never happened before or since. <clears throat> yeah. But who knows, there might be, like, barrier skip for one Waker. Yeah, like, you never know. Yeah. They might find something. Or someone will do it again during a run and you'll be able to compare the two and see what they did the same. Yeah. It'd be so good for a press runs though. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it really would. Like, it might actually remove every A-press from TikTok Clock, except for the ones that are used to enter the stage. Well, I mean, if it turns out to be, like, something you can do other places, it might just, like, take out most A-presses in the whole game. No, there's there's A-presses that, uh, you, like, that require more than just, like, being able to upward. Yeah, but like it, it might ones... take out a few more, you know. Yeah. Might. Like, it just depends on how broken it is once they figure out why it happened. Or if it can even happen again. Yeah. Pennant said that it happened, like, right at a spot that's a crux between two ceilings. Just like the up warp in Bowser's. Bowser 2. But yeah. for some reason, they just, like, can't replicate it at all. It's because there's, like, a climbable ceiling or something in a bowser too yeah that's like the difference the weird thing is there's not a kind of ceiling in tiktok about it just happened mm -hmm. that's strange oh my god Where are you at? Going to BLJs. Oh, I just finished BLJs. If I get all three of these throws on my PB. Yeah. <laughs> 
Dude, hit it. Oh, yeah. But one more chair. Hit it. What? That was dead on. He didn't go far enough. I always do that. Looks like he was going far enough. That's good. Okay, I'm finished. Yeah, more like rip your old DB. Yeah. Back to back PBs? Well, now my um, racing PB is 2126. So that's, that's actually cool. like a real one. An improvable real one, but like it's real. Yeah. I'm so sad that my runs aren't valid. It's gonna take a while for me to get good enough at my new strats to like make it so I can get below 20 minutes with them. Again. <clears throat> but in the long run, it, it'll make me a lot better. Yeah. Hopefully, when I do another run again, after doing all this practice, I'll uh, not lose like 20 minutes on this one area. Because I've just been practicing the same area like this entire time. I know, but that's going to make you choke whenever you get to a run, because you're going to be like, yeah, practice this. And yeah, it, but then, fall apart. After, like, after I've choked it at least like twice, I'll be good. <laughs> yeah. Then, and then it'll be alright, once you get used once to it. Once I've moved on to a different area. Like... Yeah. At least okay, I you practiced... still always... Wait, what? No, at least I practiced the worst room in the game. Yeah, what, what's the worst room in the game? Like, what do you even have to do? Um... Well, it's like, that's its official name. The worst room in the game. And you, like... It's full of these enemies that do 50 damage and you have, like... 300 life and they cause lag whenever they shoot so you have to like not let them shoot so you gotta like enter the room quickly jump hit this guy on that's on the wall but only hit him with like the corner of your shot because that freezes him if you don't he doesn't freeze uh here wait it's actually i could just link like a bot that has a the one room is the one yeah I just love that it's called the worst room in the game, because it actually is. Like, is that what it's called, or is that what the speedrun community calls it? It's what the speedrun community calls it. Like, if you go to the Super Metroid Wiki, it's called the worst room in the game. Well, that's funny. Well, it's gonna be tight. They should, they should call LBLJ the worst trick in the game. Like, yeah, call it the worst trick in the game. I got a 24! Was that a PB? Yeah. Good sick. Good job. You saw my best go down? Yeah, two minutes f or 20 minutes flat. Dude, that's cool. Mine is 19.07 right now. I came so close to saving time on that last split, but I lost 0.8 seconds. Dude, my summer best was like uh, 18.44 or something, and then I changed my route and it ruined my gold splits, so now it's like it looks bad again. Yeah. <clears throat> well, I'll be right back. Right. Dude, you're so close to sub 20. Uh, that's not the best. So close. As close as you can get. Yeah. Like. Oh man, if I hadn't died on Dark Gate Bowser and then I died in the Spirit World and I got burned in Lethal Lava Land and 
I missed the elevator in Hazy Maze Cave. And yet you still PB'd by like a minute. I'm just playing a lot cleaner in everywhere else. Yeah, like your movement actually makes sense and you're not forgetting stuff. Yeah. You also forgot to do the right star in uh, wants. Oh yeah. And still save time. That was last run. I remember to do it this time. Oh, you did? Okay. Yeah. As soon as I get Outlas and Womps, because uh, I go for it twice, as soon as I get it one of those two times, I'll be five seconds off that split. Or more if I get it the first try. Here we go! This is PB night. We're going for three PBs in a row. Oh my god, dude, the triple? The triple. Oh, we just got the double. Order. Two quick ones. Every once in a while, I'll make a reference to that video, and like, really, just really hope the person's seen it, and they never have. So how have you not seen Ryan Lockwood? Who? Wait, what? Have you not seen Streets 112? Um... That would blow my mind. Streets 112? Like, um... Go on map? my stream and click on this link. What? Yeah, it's it's Ryan Lockwood when he gets Streets 112 and Goldeneye. I've probably I, seen it. I probably just don't remember like the name and stuff. Just click on that link in my stream and it'll take you dude. to where you want to go. Why don't you send it in Discord, dude? <laughs> I don't want to open your stream. Lazy. I didn't even know that there was a website for it like this. Oh, that just goes to it. Uh, that's Trey, you have this start. entire thing memorized, don't you? What? You have this whole thing memorized, don't you? I do, yeah. Me too, dude. It's about time I got a fucking lucky break in this fucking game, and I clutched the goddamn oh. grenade launcher. Oh, uh, yeah, I've seen that. Yeah. There's no way I couldn't yeah. see that, yeah. Streets 112, dude. Yeah, I just didn't remember that it was Streets 112, and I also didn't remember his name. But yeah, yeah, I've totally seen that. I knew as soon as I clicked on it. Me and fucking Mark Reed too. The best part about this video was when I learned that this wasn't even a world record. Mark Reed who had already set the world record. Yeah. He well, just the tied way that the world, world records. Record. Yeah, the way that world records work in Goldeneye is different. The, the best part about this video, really, is that this is no longer the world record. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That there's like 30 people that have Streets 111 right now. Oh yeah, Aztecs tell me I need to work on Final Bowser because I literally still do a casual run through of that level. Oh yeah, you really need to do some like actual stuff. Yeah, I need to grind that out. I'm gonna do a few more runs and then I'll consider it. When I start not consistently PBing, then I'll, uh, then I'll go look up some speed strats for that. Here, wait, before you start another one though, here is this video. It starts just before the worst room in the game. It starts in pillar setup room and then goes to pillar's room, but that takes like a couple seconds. Because that's just like part of the whole thing. Like, you have to do this incredibly difficult trick called fast pillars, which saves like 20 seconds. So you like, kind of have to do it, um, which involves a, just a really hard strat. It's kind of hard to explain why it's hard, but it is. It's kind of like a backwards long jump, but without mashing, it's just precise. But like, and then you go into the worst room in the game, and it's just such a hard room. Thank you so much for playing in my game. Like everything lags, everything. Oh wow, that looks crazy. Yeah, and this that is the easiest that looks like a nightmare. to do that in. <laughs> That's crazy. The low percent strat is insane. Because you can't just freeze the guy at the beginning. I think the thing that bothers me most about this game is that you're so zoomed in that you pretty much have to memorize the entire layout of the like game to I be guess, able to do it I mean, fast. If you were zoomed out, it wouldn't help much because the whole game's point is that it's like a massive, massive world. Like that's not that's connected in every single way. Like there's connections everywhere, so you you just kind of have to learn the route. 
Yeah. You gotta know where you're going. What's the time I know about stamp? The Yeah, he does fast pillars, which I just learned, but like I'm never gonna get into run because I practiced it. It's a super difficult short charge, and then immediately goes into. Uh, this guy's not even good. Which guy? Oh yeah, hey Wise. The guy that I linked in that. Oh yeah, you're right. You're Bro, you're I just got back-to-back -back PBs, what do you mean? Yeah, okay. Tell me when you're not. Tell me when you're the fucking like, top 300 <laughs> times, man. Dude, there isn't a single top 300 Super Mario 64 runner in this channel. <laughs> wow. wow. That was rude. <laughs> Uh, it's like, for me, I yeah, think I, I was care. top 300. I'm not sure. But with your fake no, you times, were. You, you were, were like top, you were 120. Yeah. You're just not by the rules. Yeah, by the rules, I'm not. It's okay, because I'm gonna get an even better time and then submit it. And then they're gonna be like, wow, this guy's good. They're yeah, not gonna, gonna say that. <laughs> if Trey will wait like two minutes, I'm gonna finish eating. You it won't. Let me download the game real quick. <laughs> no way, I got this on a cartridge, but I just gotta get my headset cord stretched out. I can see my TV. I wish I still had my N64. And my GameCube. That'd be nice. That would be nice. Yeah. It's like I had a GameCube with a shitload of stuff in it, and an N64, and then my house burned down. Wow. Yeah, your house is supposed to not do that. Yeah, it's definitely less than optimal. I never got another one though. Oh my god, the Ridley fight looks so frustrating. The Ridley fight? Yeah. Oh, you should get to that in that video. The Ridley fight in this category is not bad. It's pretty easy.